Well, Senator Feinstein received lots of well wishes and praise here at the Lake Tahoe Summit for her work over the last three or so decades to protect this very region. And now lawmakers from both sides of the aisle of the next generation say they vow to do the same. At Kings Beach on the California side of Lake Tahoe, Hundreds of people gathered for the 27th annual Lake Tahoe Summit, an event all about protecting this region and addressing climate. The climate crisis is so urgent. Congress member and former House Speaker Nancy Pelosi gave the keynote address. She was among several California and Nevada lawmakers from both sides of the aisle who urged action, especially to protect regions just like this one. Because the climate crisis is having a direct impact it's a dire impact on both of our states. We can all agree on the goal of protecting something that is larger than any of us. That's why Democratic and Republican lawmakers who spoke here say they support extending the Lake Tahoe Restoration Act through 2034 instead of letting it expire next year. For more than two decades, the legislation has provided resources and funding for the lake and surrounding areas. We have a responsibility for uh, protecting today's lake and the lake Tahoe of the future. But that aside, attention at the summit turned to the person who helped launch this annual event nearly three decades ago, California's senior senator Diane Feinstein. She was not in attendance this time amid recent health challenges, including a bout with shingles and most recently this week, what her office described as a minor fall at her San Francisco home that led to a short precautionary visit at the hospital. As Pelosi described it. Almost a non-event, but it, uh, be on the safe side, they said, let's go to the hospital. She was there shortly and they said there's no reason for you to be here so she went home. I spoke with her this morning. Her response to me was why all the fuss? Yeah, uh, classic Diane. Well, she's back at work and at a critical time. Speakers at the summit paying tribute to Feinstein and her career. She herself even pre-recorded this audio message. Thank you all for supporting this magnificent lake, the jewel of the Sierras. I wish you all the best. I look forward to seeing you soon. And California Governor Gavin Newsom did not attend this conference, but Nevada GOP Governor Joe Lombardo said the two met earlier this week and are committed to protecting this environment. Reporting from Lake Tahoe, covering local news that matters, Aton Wallace, Fox 40 News.